This video is sponsored by Qualcomm. Hi everyone, Ta here. Today I wanted to share some of my favorite tech that I carry with me on a regular basis. Starting with the bag, this is from Nike. This is called the Nike Essentials Crossbody. It's actually very simple and that's part of the reason why I like it so much. For something that I'm carrying on a daily basis, I wanted something that could blend in with my outfits while still being, you know, sort of stylish. It comes in a few different colors, including a more stealthy black, but this green one is so nice. Green is also my favorite color, which made it a no-brainer. It has two zipper compartments, the one in the front for smaller things, and the main one for larger things. Overall, great bag, great size, and it's not all that expensive either. The one question I keep getting over and over again is what phone am I using? Well, the answer to that is the Galaxy Z Flip 3. I love this phone. My personal SIM has been in this since it came out. Every time I pull this out in public, the reactions are always so priceless. Like recently, I was holiday shopping and I pulled up my phone to show the sales rep an item I was looking for. And she was like, wait, what? That's a phone? I'm also a huge fan of the silicone ring case from Samsung. I seriously use this ring all the time while talking on the phone or just carrying it around like this. On my wrist is the Galaxy Watch 4. I use it mainly to check notifications, respond to messages, and to take calls. But my favorite use for it is to pay for everything when I'm out. It's so convenient. Just tap and go. No more diving into my bag, looking for my wallet. I can literally just pay for everything from my wrist, which is so freaking cool. For protection, I added a bezel ring because I am a klutz. I literally slammed it against the door the first day I got it. So yeah. I'm not taking any chances. All right, the Bose Quiet Comfort earbuds with Qualcomm's Bluetooth chipset have everything I need from a pair of everyday earbuds. They're comfortable, stay put, sound great with plenty of bass, but my favorite thing about them by far is the industry leading noise canceling technology. These earbuds are incredibly effective in quiet mode, completely muting out disruptive background sounds so I can stay focused and enjoy my music without any distractions. If I'm out and about, a single double tap on the left earbud switches me to aware mode so that I can hear my surroundings. Qualcomm's chips are designed to offer premium wireless connectivity, high levels of integration, immersive sound quality, and on-device AI. The end result for you, a great wireless audio experience. Over the past few months, I've started to really grow an interest in photography. Now, I don't always lug this camera along with me, but taking photos on my hikes and walks has been really relaxing and super fun. This is the Sony a6400 paired with the Tamron 17 to 70 millimeter lens. I feel like a total nerd saying that because unless you're into cameras, those names are gonna sound like a whole bunch of gibberish. I'm also going to be spending a lot of time with family over the holidays, so I'm really excited to capture a whole bunch of memories. Something that I recently picked up that I am absolutely loving is this camera strap from Peak Design. Shout out to my girl Tech Me Out for putting me on this. I'm not gonna lie, it is really expensive, but it's really well built. The best thing about this is the quick release design. Check out how satisfying this sounds. Other side. And to take it out, just simply press down and slide it out like this. Yeah, this ain't going anywhere. It's solid. On my old camera strap, the hook kept getting loose. So I actually dropped my camera a couple of times and broke one of my lenses. So lesson learned, do not cheap out on the strap. I would love to carry all three of these things on a daily basis, but the truth is that it's just way too much bulk. So I'll grab one depending on what I feel like doing that day. The iPad mini is probably the one I reach for most often because it's the most versatile. It's the perfect size for taking notes, watching Netflix, or just browsing the web when I'm on the go. One of my personal goals this year is to read more books. So an e-reader has been a game changer for me. Sure, I can stick with the iPad, but for longer reading sessions, an e-reader has been so much easier on my eyes and it's less distracting. It also doesn't need to be charged for weeks at a time. So that's one less thing for me to worry about. Highly recommend if you want to get in the habit of reading more. The Nintendo Switch is what I carry when I'm in the mood for gaming. This is like the perfect console for me because I'm a really casual gamer. Being able to start and stop playing whenever, wherever is also really nice. Something that I always carry with me is 
a power bank. I am always paranoid about running out of battery. I legit have battery anxiety because you never know if something crazy happens, you need to call for help or record something. You check your phone and you realize you're down to like 5% battery life. I'm saying this might save you. The battery on the Galaxy Z Flip 3 ain't all that great either. So it's nice having that extra juice just in case. I've got a simple card holder to store my ID and maybe a bit of cash just in case something goes wrong with my watch. I've got my keys attached to this key organizer from OrbiKey. This is actually pretty popular. It keeps your keys neatly stacked on top of each other like this so that when you throw it in your purse or your bag, you don't have to worry about your keys scratching up other things. Oh, there are a few other cool accessories that I've added over the years that have been really helpful. This is a hardware security key for all my online accounts. If you do any type of online work, I highly recommend you look for a reliable password manager and one of these to protect yourself from ever getting hacked. I used to carry a bunch of different cables, but no, 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 not anymore. This is a universal cable that you can attach to your keys. Check out how small that is. Is that not cute? One end converts from USB-A to USB-C, while the other converts from USB-C to Lightning. So this pretty much has me covered for emergency charging. This thing here is a SD card reader that I use to transfer photos from my camera onto my phone or tablet when I'm on the go. It also comes in really handy if you have a laptop that doesn't have a SD card slot. This way I can edit and share pictures right away. Anyways, that's a quick breakdown of what I'm rocking these days. I've always found it interesting to see what type of stuff people are carrying around with them. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video as well. As usual, thank you so much for watching. Until the next one. Oh, and happy holidays. <laughs> Until the next one, I'm out of here. <laughs>